that's the verdict of NBA expert Jalen Rose. The Lakers own a 28-29 record after losing 117-113 to the Atlanta Hawks last week, putting them below .500 for the first time since November. Los Angeles have won just three of their last 11 games and have gone 8-15 since Christmas Day, when LeBron sustained a groin strain that coincided with a slide down the Western Conference standings. Having been fourth on December 25th, the injury hit Lakers are now 10th and three games behind the LA Clippers in the final playoff spot. The 16-time NBA champions are seeking a first trip to the postseason in five years having fallen out of contention in the West. This is the longest stint in their history that they have gone without the playoffs. But of their remaining 25 games of the regular season, the Lakers face 18 contests against teams currently in the playoff picture in the West or the East. And Rose thinks LeBron, a four-time MVP, will have to elevate his performance to be one of the best players in the league from now until April 10th if the Lakers are to turn things around and get into the eighth seed or higher. Rose told Get Up, on ESPN, LeBron has to be MVP-level dominant and you can point to the team's record before he got injured Christmas Day, but you can also point to the strength of their schedule, LeBron James's task with leading. The Lakers back to the playoffs image, Getty, Jalen Rose told Get Up, that he thinks the Lakers will miss out on the playoffs image, ESPN, they can't afford to have any injuries Jalen Rose, it was one of the easiest in the game. The remaining part of the year they have the fourth toughest schedule, they can't afford to have any injuries, the Lakers miss Lonzo Ball, they're going to need him to be healthy and performing in the second half if they're going to find a way. To make the playoffs, the Lakers beat the Boston Celtics on the road before the break, with Boston boasting a strong 23-8 record at TD Garden, but Rose reminded his peers of the significance of their loss in Atlanta. He added, we also saw them against the Hawks, the Los Angeles Lakers have endured a difficult last couple of months, image, Getty, LeBron James's team won the All-Star game against a team captained by Giannis Antetokounmpo, image, Getty, the same Hawks that beat the Lakers lost the next game to the Knicks, who had lost 18 straight games, the Lakers that went into the break, they don't look like a playoff team, LeBron and the Lakers return on Thursday night against James Harden's Houston Rockets at Staples Center, 7.30 p.m., Friday 3.30 a.m. UK time, Harden is one of the frontrunners for the MVP award as it stands, having gone 31 straight games of scoring 30 or more points for Houston. Milwaukee Bucks superstar Giannis Antetokounmpo is also a candidate.